the video I go on. It's so many in love, isn't it? It's a guano forest. Watch this. We run road, we they run road. Step anywhere from the gun, them load. See me jump off, see me like toad. Jaggy jaggy sit in a no wild man coat car. Run road, we they run road. Step anywhere from the 16 load. See me jump off, see me like toad. Jaggy jaggy sit in a no wild man coat. To win a your place, close gas kit something. Mother in a black white rice with money. K brawling tree like it shuffle. Never want ears to me cleaning in a couple more. I see in a city crap, city chop. Mana run, mana run, mana drop. Me a teller, me a teller, it a map. Pull it out of when the case start map car. Head shot, to see me now be a shot. Two in a your face, six feet under that. On the spot news media, we got the latest news. We don't care about the views, we just representing right. Put local news internationally every night. On the spot, wave that Jamaican flag from left to right. Let's get it right, y'all know the type. We ain't dealing with the hype. We make it take flight. Yeah, man, my viewers and subscribers, what a go on. A blessed and wonderful Saturday morning to each and every person out there tuning in to On The Spot News Media. Now, my peeps, I don't know how we do it over on this side each and every morning. We have to give thanks and praise to the Most High Creator for the preservation of life because life is indeed the greatest. So we are going to revisit one of the most horrific and tragic scenes that has ever hit the 41 Rosites area of Montego Bay. And I refer to it in such a manner simply because the three persons that lost their lives are powerhouses, literally, in the 41 Rosites area. Namely, Two Fly, we are talking about Bambrain, and of course we are talking about Chip God or Chippy, depending upon who calling him name. Now the detectives that visited that crime scene recovered 49 spent casings from that scene. To include 48, which belongs to a M16 high powered rifle. So you know, say the man them will come come sting up the corner, definitely come arms up. Probably a just one person alone had a 9mm pistol. And that was probably the driver and him squeeze off a one can and stamp theme ground whilst the brutal onslaught was being taken place. Some of peeps, me I gotta ask 41 Rosites people a question right now. On a really warm peace restored in on a community. This is the crime scene, by the way. Look on the view that them people you have because them literally sit right on the hill right there. So. And them have a decent view of the whole of Antigua be a certain type of way. So now that the question was asked to the residents of 41 Rosites to include Matches Lane, the whole place, the whole 41 we are talking about, right? Or so, on a really warm peace and tranquility to be restored to the community, then why on a don't give up or speak out against the wrongs we are going in our community? On a know the main perpetrators of certain type of things within on a space. I will not talk about the regular busted name them that we always talk about. We not talk about the J-man. We not talk about the Rayman. We not talk about the Fredman. We not talk about the regular busted man them like that. We are talk about some different names. Names that has not yet been mentioned. And as always, you know, on this part, news media know a little bit more than we want to feel like him know. And I got call just two names. Two out of the many. I got just call who names to know and ask the question why uno a cover for these persons me a talk about one from literally in the matches box persons from 41 rosites we understand we and the spot news media mean by that so this one man will literally live in the matches box we run the matches box we are talk about a you to them call big show why uno a cover for big show. And then we are going to talk about the man with the previous triple murder. Go on, right a theme gate. We are talking about a youth with them call 
Birdman, why are you covering for these two persons, knowing fully well that they are way more dangerous than even the trigger men? We are talking about the J man and the Ray man and the Fred man. Them, them man, there is basically the killy killy upon the ground. But uno know say the strength with them a fight with a come from behind another source. Some peeps on really want peace back in our community. That is the question. Me I go look in at the comment sections and check my DMs. We see well uno I go say about that now. So anyway, make we move on. So word in the street that Wednesday night's brutal onslaught was perpetrated by fatted and fem set all dirty kind of boy them we get to understand say them roll up and do the dirt there but you know the funny thing is a nether set a man a claim the knockings and clappings basically say a them do the dirt and they put out certain statements to state their claim we are talking about bad breed waltham and of course, we all know that the head cook and buckle washer for the bad breed Waltham gang is this dirty corner boy on your screen that goes by the name of Ramos. No, Ramos is not in Jamaica anymore. In fact, Ramos lives in the United States of America and literally staying off the shores of Jamaica and a call the shots pan a whole lot of knockings and clappings. Want to see a go on out there? Now, the bad breed man them put out that statement here right now. I want to read this on the screen. And it reads like you feel like a plating in a this. If I want more a drop to this week. I guess she fly high and I guess they are making reference to two fly. One thing me know, woman, for act as woman and leave man to man badness alone. You no feel you innocent. Nuff Efre, the boy J man, go on with. Remember, uno slap we man grandmother. Remember, uno slap we man grandmother. Now, who lost a grandmother sometime last year, January? Who remember this lady pound a screen or so right now? Well, this lady is the grandmother of Ramos who is also the leader for the Waltamese gang, who is also arch rivals for the six, no matter which side of the six you depend, Ramos war all six. So the message continues to say, until death fussy, me know on the belly weak right now, boy cry, yeah man. So him basically I say no, no sleep because him team fully up because them no say, Uno a plan and him dead a wait. And he also made this statement. Listen to what I go on. Pussy, you know, a friend him can't plan for the three points. We have a 34. We have a 4 or 5. We have rounds more than boxing match. Pussy, we can't do this all day. All day. So I guess the bad breed man them mouth full of rhymes. The man say him have more rounds than boxing match. And him can do this whole day, whole night. Because him knock his and clap his them up and waiting. Yeah man, may I tell you. So this story just about to get interesting. Because not only the bad breed man them war any side of the six where them depan. Them man ya I got team up now. With a next set of old dirty corner boy from out of Lilliput. Only remember the other day, me drop a blog pan a boy with them call Nikilo Lewis, otherwise known as Akilo or Kilo from out of Lilliput. And when the police them wall and pan him, I be a beg him a beg and a plea for him like a three pints. Well, Nikilo Lewis have a boss that goes by the name of Bujo. Now, Bujo and Ramos. A childhood friends used to go to the same school, so you don't know them have a little understanding from them time there. Now, this is Bujo on your screen. And Ramos and Bujo basically team up now. 
because everybody a try to draw for everybody where them can get to increase them manpower basically. So man got start prove gun strength because them team up with each other. So Bujo, we get to understand say, the import of them where you bring in from town, come down and mobile there, come clear the strap them what there. Yeah. The police them know about it. And the police them go warn them strap there. They wanna just come clear from half of the free port wharf. So yeah man my peeps, the free port wharf still fully active. Knockings and clappings still are coming through the wharf same way. When I don't know how Jamaica system running now, from your money strong enough. Yeah, man, them will take the risk and show it in for now. So we know about the strap them we come in for Bujo. So right there and then, you know, say, Ramos team get extra strong right and now. But the whole thing is not just Ramos alone. I seek outside help. I want to sit back and listen to this piece of information and now carefully. For those who have been tuning into On The Spot News Media for some time now, would have remembered when on the spot news media did a blog on the Salem faction of the RH gang. Well, I am here to inform you right now that the busted, the 41 Rosites busted man them, J-Man, has joined forces with the old dirty kind of boy with them call old Modera. Yeah, man, may I tell you, from the Salem faction of the RH gang. Well, just for those who are still in shock, and for those who are in disbelief, I want to look panda picture here right now. Who is that in the full orange? I want to zoom it up, look closely and tell me who that in the full orange. The next man will stand upside a J-man who is in the full orange by the way. Them call him Papa P. The next man, them call him Nigga. The fat brother, of course, them call him Biggs. Right beside Biggs, a one of the key knackis and clappies in the RH gang. Them call him Angelo. And of course, out on the end, is the real crab up head man himself. What them call all murderer. Yeah, man. Them call him all murderer for a reason, man. So you know, say, right and now. J-Man I get him team strung up just the same because him have the next side of six a war with and also the Walter Mees bad breed man them. Yeah man may I tell you so right now no, my peeps the gates of hell as me repeatedly say has opened into the Montego Bay space. I don't know how the squad of them in a mobile are going to manage this thing here you know, because this thing here has spiraled out of control. Because as you can hear from Ramos, the bad breed top man, so them member, so them granny end up lose them three pints. And it is widely spread that a J man and Rayman them did go do the dirt there. We now have no concrete proof because that was in the heights of the face mask wearing and everything. But you don't know people in the streets know where go on. So people name the knackis and clappies them. We go do that dirt there. And not only did Ramos' grandmother lose her life on that horrific night, but two other males also lost their lives. Right at the car wash this man, where the little party did a go on in the New Year's festive season there. So right in the heights of the Uga Lane and the Gulf War. So who remember when time that go on? Drop some comments in the comment section and make a whole of reasoning about it. Or basically help out the ones and ones them who lost to a on the spot news media. Basically a talk about. So you see the fact that J-Man woman get dirt right now. We are talk about two fly. Right now the game, the knockings and clappings we are going in a Montego Bay right now. No have no more rules to it. Right now, not even the baby pan breast safe. Because once you bring in woman in the war thing, the next side I got just say, alright, well I saw it ago. Woman and Pitney I got just get flushed then. Because right after the triple we go on right up in the 41 Rosites era, the man them go make a strike, pan shop than mother. Luckily for her, she was not at the shop and a nether man lose him three pints courtesy of the old dirty kind of boy them. So when the sister right now, there is no more rules to the game and this is where it gets seriously 
dangerous. Because all along, a beer man I get clap with left, right and centre. But the man them broke the unwritten rule right and now. So there is literally no more rules to go by. So all those persons living in the Montego Bay space and want to play careless with your three pints because you know, feel like you know, if you stand up at every little corner, every little pan where you knock and every little music where I play and go give a phone the three pints. You know, they on the own. Slowly but surely, all I want to be careless with phone one, I go make it per on the spot news media. So as always, a word to the wise is always sufficient. So people, you say from on innocent, take heed. On a can say on innocent people and go and stand up at a known gunman, a known old dirty kind of boy, birthday party. We don't expect to get out of that. Literally, you don't get it. Yeah, man, may I tell you, 49 spent casings, 48 of which belongs to M16 rifles. That is the ultimate price you pay when you find yourself in the company of them old dirty kind of boy. So my peeps, I always say, a word to the wise is definitely sufficient. So anyway, my peeps, remember to like, share, subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned to On The Spot News Media as I continue to bring you fresh news and updates in subsequent newscasts. On The Spot News Media. Yeah, man.